Alright, so I'm gonna move to do some real fucked up shit. Book my friend Roman a flight to Tokyo because he's been here all summer and I'm getting sick of him. Let me go tell him he's gotta go. You up? Yo, you gotta go, bro. Um, I've just booked you a flight. Um, Tokyo Uber's here in 30 minutes, so you have to get ready. Just throw some shit on. I packed you a bag with like your passport and shit because it's all in my room. Tokyo? Yeah, can you? Yeah, you, you've been Dude, here. Chill. It's not funny. I need to go to sleep. Bro, you've been here for too long. Get out of here, bro. Get out of here for a few days. Go culturize yourself. To Tokyo? Yeah, here. What does that even mean? Bro, just take this camera. Take this. Take this shit. What? Take this shit. I put $200 cash in your bag. You have everything you need, your Uber's here in 30 minutes though, so for real, you should hurry, I already called the gate for you. Is this, is this a if prank? You have, you need anything, or you need is this a prank? Don't FaceTime me. Alex. It'll charge your account. Is this a prank? No, it's not, dead ass. Uber's here in 30, get changed. All right, I guess I'm going to Tokyo. All right, at the airport. I don't know what's going on really. I'm still kind of confused from everything. Um, Alex sent me out here. I got hella yen though. Crazy amounts of yen, bro. 200k of yen. Probably balling out here, bro. No, actually, it's only like $200 American. Alex, I hate you. I really fucking hate you. Just know that I hate you for this. So yeah, um, I'll keep you guys posted on this crazy trip. Ladder. Look how happy he is. But his best friend didn't send his ass to Tokyo. I really don't know how I ended up here, to be honest with you. Um, I'm kind of just here. Alex, fuck you for this. I'm gonna try to make the best out of it. I'm gonna try the culture out. So I just got on the train, I guess. I don't know, even, even the escalators are different. Like, we go down on the, like, I don't, I don't, I can't explain it. Everything's tripping me out, though. I can't figure anything out by myself. Like, I, if I didn't have help right now, I'd be fucked. Like, this language barrier thing is crazy, but, I'm at the train. I think this is where I'm supposed to be. I just asked a random ass dude. He's like, yeah, right here. I'm like, bet. So I just got out of the train station. Now I'm, I'm in, I don't fucking know where I am. I'm somewhere lit though. Where's that fucking train? Oh, let's get it. I'm gonna just walk. I might ask just a random person because I'm really confused and I really have no idea where I'm going right now. All right, yo. I figured since I was from Arizona that like, I'm pretty much capable to to withstand like any type of hot weather, you know what I mean? But yo, this shit's fucking hot, son. This shit's burning, bro. And I'm not fucking with it. I mean, there's a breeze right now. Oh, this is the best that fell all fucking day in Tokyo. I don't even have a hotel. I need to get a fucking hotel right now before I fucking die. So I need to get this hotel. I'm trying to find Shibuya. Like, I need to just go around. I need a skirt. I need to, I need to figure it out. I need to figure it out. I really don't know where I'm going. I'm, I'm gonna be straight honest. I'm just winging this entire fucking trip right now. Find the hotel. Settle it down, be ready, you know, because like I'm freaking out right now. Honestly, I have a bit of an anxiety attack. This is the sketchiest fucking hotel. This is like a hotel to go to. All right, all right, so I can't say it because like obviously like, but like it's a hotel for that type of stuff to go down. You know what I mean? That like, that like, how I know? I was like, oh, it's just a hotel, 6,000 for a night, that's chill. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? What hotel room comes with this shit, dog? Just fucking stay away from that. <laughs> About to go get some food. I don't know, dude. I'm, I'm in like Hooker Island right now. I swear to God. No one knows what I'm saying because we're all Japanese, but like straight up Hooker Island. It's lit. It's so lit. I'm not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's try the culture. I'm, I'm down. I'm down to, down to see what, what Japan's got because I'm used to that uh, California, Asian food. So let's, let's check this shit out. All right. So I went up to these random dudes and they were telling me I was like, Yo, what should I eat? Like, what's the good spots to eat around here? Brought me up to this Chinese food place. He's like, Chinese? You good with Chinese? I'm like, Chinese in Japan? He's like, oh yeah, it's fire. So I'm gonna try it out and let's see what, see what it's like. Fuck that, they kicked me out because I didn't speak Japanese. What the fuck is that? I was just like, yo, just put me at a table. And they're like, no, 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 Japanese. I'm not trying to be racist, that's exactly what she said. But like, for real, like, all right, so I guess I have to find something else that has, speaks English. Bro, so many fucking prostitutes have come up to me, man, and just asking me like, yo, blow job, hand job, blow job, hand job. I'm like, I'm not really with it right now, honestly, like, I appreciate the offer, but I'm not down. I'm gonna go up to any white person I know. Obviously, like, if I see them and they're white, they're probably gonna speak English, right? Wrong. They don't speak English. Every white person I've been up to does not speak English. I can't find another Mexican. I can't find another brother over here. I don't know what's going on. I'm gonna figure it out. I don't know what to do. I might go back outside. I didn't eat last night because I wasn't hungry. So let's go find something to eat. I got my Gucci. I brought my Gucci shades on so like people can uh, know it was good. Good. It's young Roman, aka Chai Roman, aka Fuck Your Bitch. I don't know how to fucking work the shower. Like the shower is the trippiest thing ever. Like, let me see this shit. This shit is like, I don't know. I try to work it and then like it floods. This shit all floods. I don't know if that's supposed to be like that. Alright, cool. So, um, 
found someone who speaks English, an American buddy. What's your name, man? Yo, I'm Al. What's it? Al? Al. Al, all right, I met Al. First person I met that I can actually, I can have a conversation with. Um, you recommend anything to get some food, bro? You know where I can go? The ramen spot. Right ramen spot right up the road over here? Yeah, about two clicks. All right, two clicks this way. Where are you from, Al? You guys, shout out to Al for the help. We're gonna go get this ramen. Hopefully I don't die or get lost. Appreciate it, man. You have a good day. I don't care. You see me flexing. You see how I'm rocking like this? Car coming. I don't know who that is. But I'm still looking good. I'm still looking fly. So, I still don't know where to go. I'm trying to figure it out. No one wants to help me out. Hey guys, um, you know where I can get food? Food? No food, like, to eat? <laughs> I didn't understand what I'm saying. Oh, shit. Look at my dude over here. He's gone. He is gone. Oh, shit. No, he's... he's uh, This is what happens when you get Tokyo, when you, when you let Tokyo get Tokyo. He got Tokyo'd out, nigga. He got Tokyo'd. So I'm, I think he's chilling. I just think he got a little too fucked up. Which is, you know, it's what happens here, I guess. So I decided to try um, the culture, you know? Experience Japan. Because I'm only here for like a couple days, so I'm trying to really experience the food. Like, I really want to get that uh, Japan feeling. Which is, it's not bad, you know? It's really good. Make it easier is fire. All right, so I have the best Japanese McDonald's you could ever find anywhere in Japan. If I saw a Whataburger here, I probably would lose my shit. Cause like I'm from Texas, growing up in Texas, Whataburger was like the best thing ever in the world. Like if you're from Texas, you know what I mean. Whataburger and Dairy Queen, best things ever. And Dr Pepper and Big Booty Bitches, but like that's a different story. I don't know where I'm at. Big ass crosswalk place thingy maybe. Um, I'm gonna just I'm gonna just walk around. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go find the Starbucks. Get, get some Wi-Fi and then go live. All right, so I'm in Tokyo. I see my guys over here offering a free hug. So I'm gonna get a free hug. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Everybody, let's go. Let's get it. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Thank you. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. See you guys. Free hugs. I'm down. Came here for the Wi-Fi, but I'm gonna get a drink with it too to see what's up. I have no idea. Hello. Um, let me see, let me see. Do you have like a, uh, uh, let me see. Water, do you have water? Water, mineral water? Yeah. Watering water? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna get a water. All right. I went back to the hotel, I took a quick nap. I was tired as hell. Uh, Japanese fan maybe? I don't know what, maybe? <laughs> Jet lag really fucking me up. I'm gonna be honest with you. Like, I went out last night, I went to Hooters, saw some, you know, bad Asian bitches. It was nice. All right, I'm gonna take a quick nap, go to sleep, go to sleep for a bit, go back out. You know, nightlife is crazy out here. Wrong. I was tired, bro. I was exhausted. I could not wake up to save my life. But today, oh, it's nighttime. It's beautiful. It's really nice out right now. I'm gonna be honest with you. It's cool. I was sleeping for like the day. I was chilling. Now I'm, um, I'm gonna try something. I've been saying I'm gonna try something, but I've been too scared. I'm actually just gonna go try something. First thing I see, I'm gonna go go and get it. So let's just go check it out. Tokyo, Shibuya, let's get it. Yo, this looks fire, dude. What is this art? I'm gonna have some shit to tell you guys. Last you saw me, I was eating at like a Japanese Italian mixture. Since that moment, it went downhill. I finished eating. I was walking around for a bit, right? Chilling, looking. Then all of a sudden, that shit hit my stomach. And it fucking hurt. And I was just, I was like, damn, I can't do this. So I went back to the hotel. I chilled out for a bit. I was in the restroom for like an hour. I was like, oh my. Uh, it was just like, it was, it was going. It's my last day. Like I have to do something, you know? Like I have to do it. So I just, I went to like the store and I found like that I had the shits and they gave me something and I, and I, and I took it. Oh, okay. 
I was like, fuck, alright, I'm gonna go. So, I met this black dude, you know, I just searching around for any colored people to talk to because, like, I felt lonely. I don't like feeling lonely. I, li I like to be a part of, like, a, like a group, especially when you're in Tokyo by yourself, you know, like, oh, hey, what's up? What's poppin'? My G, how you doing? I was like, yo, where do I go to get lit? He's like, oh, I'm a security guard at this club called Monkey Shibuya. I was like, oh, bet, is it, is it lit? He's like, oh, yeah, yeah, come through. It's, it's really fun. I was like, all right, cool, I'm gonna come through. So it was nine, it was like 9.30, no, it was like 10.30 at the time. I go to security, pat me down, and they's like, you can't have recording cameras, like you can't have like, like cameras, like what I'm recording on with this. I don't know why they didn't allow that. Maybe you don't want me like videotaping or like doing promotion, some type of promotions, which I would, I won't. I just wanted to vlog myself, but like, you can't really explain, you're just vlogging yourself to a Japanese dude who doesn't know English. So he's like, nope, no cameras, so. I had to walk all the way back to the hotel, drop the camera off. I go back to the club, pat me down. He's like, all right, come in, you're good. I go in and I just get obliterated. I just like, I was like everywhere. I was lit, I was like Roman lit, like legit rock star shit. I meet these random dudes. Canada, Vancouver, he's from Vancouver. And I was like, oh yeah, it's lit, it's lit. They had a table, they invited me to their table. I don't remember much after that. I just woke up on the side of a road. Yeah, I woke up on the side of a road. I was like, where the fuck am I? So I wake up, I check my phone, 9 a.m. I was like, I bet. So I go back to the hotel, shower, you know, I relax and everything. I go on the train, I finally find, find it. Get on the ride, you know, I'm chilling. It's lit. I'm dead. I'm dead. So now I go. I'm just chilling. So it was kind of fun. I can't say it went straight to shit. Honestly, that might have been an uh, an exaggeration. It was only it was only like bad for like an hour. Just after I ate that food and I fought through it because you know I'm Roman. I don't let shit get in my way. I got Tokyo. I really did get Tokyo. I'm gonna just relax, listen to some music, and then I'll catch y'all back in LA.